Good evening, officer. Good evening. The reason I'm stopping is you made an illegal U-turn back there. Yeah, I'm sorry. I didn't realize there was a sign there. That's okay. Do you have a driver's license on you? Yeah, of course. Yo, Anthony, did you take my driver's license? What was that ID in there? What was that ID that you just pulled out? This is my student ID. Oh, I thought I saw another ID in there. There wasn't another ID behind it, right? I have my, I literally don't know where my driver's license is. Hey, it's in your pocket, you gotta show it to get in. Oh my god, yeah. Did you have another ID in your wallet that I just saw? Yeah, I did. Can I see it? Of course. Is it somebody else's or is it fake? No, it's a fake ID. Fake, fake? Yeah. Okay. Alright. What about your real one? This is your real one. That's your real one? Yeah. So you're a New York person, right? Yep. It's a pretty cool ID, actually. Yeah, it is. Okay. Is this your car? No, it's not. That's not? Okay. I'm not going to worry about the registration insurance card. Yeah, How much have you to drink tonight? I had nothing to drink. You had nothing at all? Swear to God. Swear to God. Okay. Damn, a fake ID. Damn, he made it a fake ID to a cop. Damn. Okay, we got to get back on the video. This is more I want to say right now. Well, I'm still out for Are you the DD? Yes. Okay. Do you mind stepping out just so I know it's not coming from you? Oh, of course. Yeah, make sure it's in park. I don't want to roll away. I actually had mono, so I don't know if can't even drink at all. Good liver damage. Nah. Uh, so, you haven't had any. When was the last time you had anything to drink? Probably like four months ago. Four months ago? Yeah. So you didn't have a sip tonight? I swear. So then why do you have an ID that makes you 21? Told me to go to college, have a fake ID, you know. Well, that wasn't smart, was it? No. Are you a UCF know. student? Yes. Okay. See, so that's a felony, right? Yeah. Like five years in prison, five thousand dollar fine, lose your scholarship, <laughs> all that stuff, right? Yeah. What's that? I'm like really sorry. You know, like, How long have you been a UCF student? Like. Is this your first your first it's semester? Moving day. <laughs> okay. All right, so you've never been in trouble with the university before, right? No, never. Okay. I've never been in trouble in my life, folks. So. Okay. If everything comes back and you don't have a bunch of arrests out in New York or anything like that, yeah. this is what I'm going to do. Rather than arrest you for this, mm -hmm. and I'm guessing everybody else in the car is probably drunk because there's a lot of alcohol coming from the car. Actually, someone threw up in it. And, uh, oh. Yeah. Okay, well, so it sounds we like you guys have a bunch yeah, of... Yeah, we don't have them in the car anymore. Mm -hmm. Okay. So tell you that. Well, were... the whole point, though, is, is rather than doing that and having to tow the car and all that, mm -hmm. what I'm going to do is I'll write you a student affairs referral, okay? Generally, if you have never been in trouble with the university before, what they'll do is they'll make you take, you know, some kind of awareness class. The first offense is usually educational because you didn't hurt anybody. If you rob somebody or rape somebody, then that's when they kick somebody out of the university. So, but it's better than a felony. Damn. Nice just caught the note, right? So this video is going to be uploaded and another video is going to be uploaded. Love you guys. Peace out.